Hi, today we are going to see hospital booking management main web application. So first open the Bango TP. Then connect the Mango TP. Left side you can able to see the backend database and the tables. Example like any table name. Here you can see the backend database tables. Next open the Visual Studio. First explore your project folder. Then you can see the SRC folder. It have a backend and a client folders. Open the backend folder. Here you can see the models and routers. Next go to the client. Client is the front end. Click the SRC folder. Here you can see the components. It have a real JS components files. Let's go to the readme text file. Here you can see the how to start the project in step by step procedure and login details. Next open the new terminal. First connect the backend. So enter the CD backend. Next install the node modules. Enter the npm install. I have an already installed, so I go to the next step. Enter the npm start. Now backend folder is connected. Next, <coughs> click the plus. Connect the client server. Enter the CD client. Enter the NPM running. Now we can see the project URL link. Copy to paste the web browser. So this is the project homepage. It have three roles: admin, hospital, patient, and lab. And then you will register your two roles: hospital and patients. First, we will start the hospital role. We have to sign up. Go to the register. Enter the hospital name. Then give the email ID. Then enter the password. Your password must contain at least one capital letter, one special character, then length of every digit. Then give your mobile number and city. Then click the sign up. Now register successfully. If you already register, you can use your email ID and password, then login into the home page. Enter the hospital email ID and password. And one more thing, if you first time you can log in your home page, admin will be give your approval after you log in your home page. Now you can see the hospital home page. Hospital will be manage the appointments orders and view the patient reports. First go to the post hospital. Here you will be add your hospital details. So give the hospital name, then doctor name. Then fill the all field names. 
After you fill, click the submit button. It will be created. Let's go to the view my hospital. Here you can see your posted hospital details. And then you will search to see the data. Here you can see the all data. And then if you want to edit or delete, here you can do it. Let's click the geo map. Click the allow. Now your location is updated successfully. And then go to the show map. Here you can see your location. Then go to the view appointments. Here you can see the all patients appointments order. Like go to the patient to home page. This is the patient home page. Here you can see the all hospitals. So go to the search hospitals. Here you will see the hospital data. Then if you want to book appointments, go to the book appointments. And then you will post the appointments. Enter the patient name. Then give the reason. Then select the appointment date. And then select the time slot. You select the 10 a.m. After other person cannot select the, the time and date. Let's give the address and city. Then submit your appointment. Then go to the view my appointments. Here you can see your posted appointments order. Then you can see the status. The status will be pending. Then come back to the hospital home page. Hospital home page. Now go to the view appointments. Here you can see the you posted use patient appointments order and then you will check the time slot. If you free you can update the appointments order. Click click the update status, then give the confirmation. Now update successfully. Then go to the post prescription. Here you will be sending your prescriptions. So fill the all medicine name, then enter the lab test and give the notes. After you send the prescription, then go to the medical history. Here you can see the patient medical histories. Next go to the patient treatment history. Here you can see the all prescription details. And then you will update the bill. Click the update bill. And then enter the amount and the paid amount. Then give the balance amount. And if you want to update or delete, you can do it here. If you want to export the data, click the export. And then you will upload the, download the data. Next, go to the create lab register. Here you will be clear the lab register details. So enter the lab name and email email ID. Then give the password and address. Then fill the all field name. After you fill the field, click the submit button. Next, let's go to the view lab view search. Here you can see the lab details. And then if you want to update or delete, here you can do it.
then go, go to the view patient lab reports here you will be see the all patient lab reports details then if you want to download the reports click the download button and also you will export the data click the export next go to the view feedback here you can see the patient feedbacks then my profile is used to update your contact details next we will move for the admin log enter the email id and password then login into the admin home page so this is the admin home Admin will be manage the approval hospitals and view the patient and user details. First go to the view hospital. Here you can see the all hospital data and then you, you will verify then give the approval. After you give the approval, hospital will be log in our home page. Then go to the view patient and lab user details. Here you will be see the all patient and lab details. And then if you want to search, you will search to see the data. Next we will move for the patient login. We have to sign up, go to the register and then here you will be register your home page enter the username then give your email id then enter the 8 digit password then enter the city and mobile number now register successfully After you register, you can issue your email ID and password, then login into the home page. So this is the patient home page. Here you will be see the hospital details and book your appointments first go to the search hospitals here you can see the hospital detail and then you will search to find the hospitals and also you can book the appointments then you will go to the feedback here you can send your feedbacks. Enter your name and feedback, then click the submit button. Then go to the show map. Here you can see the hospital location. Then go to the view my appointment. Here you will be see your appointment confirmation details. And then you can see your confirmation status. Next go to the my treatment history. And you can see your prescription details. If you want to check more information, click the check button. Here you can see the all details. Then go to the my lab report. Here you can see your lab reports details. Then go to the view my billing details. Here also you can see your billing, hospital billing details and you can see the total amount and paid amount and balance amounts. If you want to export the data, click the export button. Then my profile is used to update your contact detail. Next go to the lab homepage. So enter the email id and password.
now log in successfully so this is the lab home page here you will be see the patient details and you can update the patient reports first go to the view patient lab details here you can see the patient detail and test detail after you finish the test you will upload the reports click the upload button first choose the report file then select the date and then enter the test name and the range then give the actual range and enter the level after you fill the field name click the submit button it will be submitted let's go to the view my lab reports here you will be see your lab reports details if you want to remove or download you can do it here and then if you want to export the data click the export button let's go to the my profile here you can see your contact details so this is the hospital booking management mern web application Shopping.